Hi, I'm Stuart and welcome to Sarnet Television. We're going to take a look at a product that's been around for a long time. In fact, we recently did a video on this, the D4 series light. That happens to be the one in question I'm holding here in my hand. And basically what's going on here, if I peel that off, that's how it comes from the factory by the way, you can see here there are a total of four TIR3 Gen 3 Whelan LED modules inside this particular aluminum light housing. Now the D-series, or the Dominator series, comes in a variety of lengths. You can either get it as a single head, double head, four head, or six head. You could even go to an eight head if you want as well. So there's a variety of options available, and again, you can check out the website. The one I'm holding in my hand right now is the D4, and it happens to be, as I said a moment ago, with the TAR3 Gen 3 LED module. So there's basically three diodes in each of these heads. So that's this particular one. Let's stick that cover quickly back on here. That's why it always looks nice and brand new when you get it. And then I'm going to reach across here and take out this particular light. And it's a sister light, or a brother light, <laughs> to the Dominator 4 series. This is the D4 Plus, or the Dominator Plus series light. Inside here are a total of six diodes, as opposed to three. And they're using Whelan's patented linear reflector module, which is inside this particular light. That's the phone ringing. It's live television. Now, should I answer it or not? I think I should not do that. So I'm going to reach into my pocket and just push this button. So if you were the one calling, sorry. But anyway, we're going to keep rolling. So basically what we have here is the D4 Plus. It's a great light from Whelan. And I'm going to turn it on. And you've got to take a look at it here inside the building. And just now, we'll be going outside the building as well. And we will compare both of these products in a kind of a side-by-side -side outside view. So let's go turn it on real quick. I've just turned it on, hopefully not too blinding the camera crew. And as you can see, it is a very nice light, very intense. I'm going to turn it to the side here. So from an output point of view, obviously you're definitely getting more bang for the buck using the Dominator Plus series versus the standard Dominator. However, the standard Dominator does cost less. So you have to decide which one will work best for you. Now again, we're inside a warehouse amongst a lot of product. We're going to go outside and we're going to check it out and see what it looks like in the outside world. Well, as I mentioned earlier, we're going to quickly go outside, and this is a perfect time to do it. We've had some light dusting of rain um, here in the Pacific Northwest. The, the particular light on this side of the vehicle happens to be the standard Dominator 4, and the particular light on this side of the vehicle happens to be the Dominator Plus. So again, you can be the judge. This is using linear technology, and this one is using what I would call dot technology. It's essentially three diodes per head in the one on this side, and the one on this side happens to have a total of six Gen 3 diodes in the Whelan patented linear formality. Formality? Style. 